Hello, um, Black Weather here, and um, I'm going to show you how to get a letter passcode on your iPod Touch. No jailbreak. It's just like, any you don't have to do anything to your iPod. You can just get a letter passcode. Okay, first we're going to start out by going to www.stuff.iappify.passcode.com. Once again, that's www.stuff.iappify.com slash slash passcode. Okay. Oh, and by the way, you have to um do this on your Safari in on your iPod Touch. Because if you do it with anything else, like a regular computer, internet, from like your PC or what laptop, then it won't work. Okay, so you need to do this from your Safari on your iPod Touch. And once you type it in, it'll say passcode you can do several things like now once you're there it'll say um the first thing that'll come up it'll say get mod now well get the mod now so you press get the mod now okay and then it'll say come up as an It'll say install profile and a letter passcode. It is an unsigned um, download, so it's at your own risk. It will change settings from your iPod Touch. And press install now. Now enter your old, pa old passcode that you originally had if you had a passcode. I mean, if you didn't have a passcode, then it won't ask you for your old passcode. Now you, it'll, once you enter your old passcode, if you had one, it'll come up saying your n set passcode and you need to have one or more letters or numbers. So let's just start out with 1M. And then we enter 1M. And then it's installing it into your profile. And once it's finished installing, it'll say done at the top right corner and you press done now let's just now exit out to show that it actually worked and now open it and then you got letter passcode and to get it off I'm also going to show you how to get the letter passcode off if you don't like it you go to uh, settings then general um, you go at the very bottom, it'll say profile, and then it'll say right next to prof profile, letter passcode. Click on it, press remove. It will change settings in your iPod Touch. You press remove, even though you didn't change your um, old passcode to a numbered passcode. Okay, anti old, old passcode, 1M. Okay, now it's removed. Now I see exit out and then go back in. You and then once you like turn off your iPod and then go back in. It you still got a letter passcode. So um that's why you go to passcode lock in your settings, enter your old passcode. Now press change passcode. Well first once you go to change passcode, you gotta enter your old passcode. Now enter your new passcode. Let's say one, two, three, four, and it's gotta be a numbered passcode. Okay. Now let's go to the back and let's exit out. Oh, turn off. Oh, yeah. Slide to unlock, and then once you do that, finish that. You're done. Oh yeah, it's one two three four. Type in one two three four, then you're done. And if it didn't work for you, you either if you, it didn't work for you, trying to remove the iPod and then you messed up on your passcode lock, like you want, like you put letters in it, then. I, it, you know, you still have a numbered pass lettered passcode until you fix that problem. And if you're still having problems with it, then.
then you're just gonna have to restore your iPod. But once you go to a four number passcode, then um once you get to your four number passcode, it'll always stay there until you get that one up again. Thanks for watching. Please rate five stars and goodbye.